Hello all, this is RPG7, and today we are going to get eaten by a Gru. Uh, if you do not know the reference, I am referring to the game series of Zork. Now, it's going to be one shot. Um, I'm taking some time. I've pretty much vacated my room. I'm leaving tomorrow for Arizona, and I don't want to get too heavily involved with playing uh, Daggerfall right now, so... I went online and I saw that the Zork Anthology and all the Zork games were on sale at Good Old Games or GOG for 15 bucks. So I figured, what the hey? Zork was originally st uh, work on Zork was originally started in. While I'm blabbering, let me do work. Oh, that's why. Um, 79, actually. Um. And was originally for the um, the IMB systems. Um, I've never played these before. I've heard little about them. Zork and oh god. CD. Now that's not going up. It did. Cool. Zork. Now Zork is a completely text-based adventure game. Um, I've played a f a mud or two back in. I don't want to say back in the day, but when I was about twelve or so. I've played MUDs before, so I'm not completely new to using these, but I haven't played one in a while, so this should be fun. And I believe the on this it is Zork 1. Alrighty. Um let's see. Zork 1, the Great Underground Empire. Copyright 81, 82, and 83. All rights are reserved, of course. This is the revision number da. Serial number da da. West of a house. You are standing in an open field, west of a white house, with a bordered fr front door. There is a small mailbox here. Mailbox. There is no verb in that sentence. Open mailbox. Take leaflets taken. Read leaflets. Zork is a game of adventure, danger, and low cunning. In it, you will explore some of the most amazing territory ever seen by mortals. No computer should be without one. Well, mine has one now. Um... Job. Go west. This is a forest with trees in all directions. To the east, there appears to be sunlight. Um. Go east. There is a forest winding through a dimly lit forest. The path north south the path says north south here. One particularly large tree with some low branches stands at the edge of the path. Look tree. Ha. Huh. Go tree. Walk tree. Okay. Well, screw that then. Walk south. You are facing the north side of a white house. There is no door here. All the windows are boarded up. To the north. Go north. Forest path. Walk. Go north. You are in a clearing with the forest surrounding you on all sides. The path leads south. 
on the ground there's a great pile of leaves. Look. Pile of leaves. Of leaves. Look. Pile. Look. Leaves. Take. Leaves. Drop leaves. L E A V. Drop. You're going to see me derp a lot with this. I am empty handed. Huh. You're behind the lighthouse. A path leads to the forest to the east in one corner of the house. Open window. With great effort, you open the window far enough to let entry. And enter house. Kitchen. You're in the kitchen of a white house. A table seems to have been used recently for preparation of food. A passage leads to the left, and a dark staircase can be seen leading upward. A dark chimney leads to the east. There's a small window which is open. On the table is an elongated brown sack smelling of hot peppers. A bottle is sitting on the table. The glass bottle contains a quantity of water. Yell. Arg, I beg your pardon. Hello. Good day. Oh, the game won't let me have a conversation with it. Um, Living room. You're in the living room. There's a doorway to the east, a wooden door with a strange gothic lettering on lettering to the west, which appears to be nailed shut. A trophy case, a large rug in the center of a room, above the cur Ooh. Battery powered press lantern on is on the trophy case. Uh Uh, take...
take taken EQI P ah Now you see me derp at spelling. Um. You don't know how to use. Okay. Look. Case. Look. Take rug. Move rug. There's always a trapdoor under the rug. How do you not know it? You just used it. Enter. What should I do? What should I do? Um... You don't know the word loot. Oh boy. Um. Hmm. Part probably would have been smart if I did this earlier, but I am going to pop open the menu, and I've probably been recording for about 15 minutes. So I am going to pause here for a moment and get back to you in a moment. All right, we are back and I have the command list so I'm not going to be looking like a complete idiot this time alright so we can do this I did not know but um look you do not know the word quotation mark look Here we go. You are likely to be eaten by a grill. Your sword is glowing with a faint blue glow. Okay, um... Turn on...
cellar. You are now in a dark, damp cellar with an arrow passageway leading north and crawling a crawlway to the south. On the west is the bottom of a steep metal ramp, which is unclimbable. I'm assuming that's the trap door from earlier. Um, go north. The troll room. Ew. Um. Oh, a good slash, but it misses the troll by the mile. The troll's axe removes your head, and it appears the last blow was too much for you. I am afraid you are dead. Now let's now let's take a look from here. Well, you probably deserve another chance. I can't quite fix you up completely, but you can't have everything. Yep. Alrighty. So that was getting us getting killed by a troll instead of a Gru. But um yep, we're gonna call it there. I'm gonna mess around with this some more. But for now, it was me making some short content for you. So I will talk to you guys later. I am moving to Arizona hopefully tomorrow, if not Sunday. So it's about a five day trip out there. Then give me another three days to get acclimated, and then I'll be right back. Hopefully that then, uh, HP for the win. Wanted to do um, some more of those voiceover recordings. I've explained all the things to him now, so he shouldn't be as uh, derpy on it. So we have that coming to you guys, and I will have parts of my Daggerfall Let's Play once I get out there and I am able to test the ISP speed. But until now, this is RPG Set. Seven saying bye-bye.